everyone it's me who else would it be so I'm back and I have another review for you yes you're gonna be seeing this shirt in a few reviews because I'm trying to film a few I have so many to catch up on and I'm trying to film a few while I'm home alone so yeah we have Pringles Mingles yeah Pringles in a bag how about that um, Light, airy, crispy, sharp, white cheddar, and ranch. Now, they have a few flavors, and this bag was like three bucks. I got it at Walmart. They had a few flavors. This one seemed the most appealing to me. <laughs> Let's see. I don't know if this information on the back is right. It seems a little crazy to me, to be honest. That's a weird smell. I'm not a big fan of the smell. Hopefully it tastes better. Kind of smells like onion feet. Um, oh man, I forgot to do a number for the last review I did. Oh well. Um, okay, so this sounds really crazy to me. I'm like, is there really that many in this bag? Uh, says six servings per bag 56 pieces per serving I, I, I maybe that's like 300 in here or something like that that's a lot uh, 150 calories per serving 9 grams of fat 15 carbs 2 grams of protein this is what it looks like. See a little ranch. I like how it says actual size. Two flavors, one bow tie. Deliciously craveable new snack from Pringles. And each one of these is like two flavors. Like there's a pizza slash barbecue flavor one. And I can't remember the other flavors. I like sharp white cheddar, so that's why this sounded appealing to me. I'm not a big ranch fan. I'm guessing that's where the onion feet smell comes from. Ah, oh man, that one looked really good too. Well, hurry up. There you go. Did oh you jerk. There you go. That one had a lot of seasoning, so I'm kinda sad. There we go. See all that seasoning? <clears throat> okay. I'm not getting sharp white cheddar and I'm not even getting ranch. The, the texture is really nice. I can't believe there's 56 pieces in a serving or like in a serving like it's hard for me to believe there's 300 of these in here. Okay, I'm not really getting ranch and I'm not getting sharp cheddar at all. It kind of tastes like sour cream and onion dip, which I'm not a big fan of. My mom is. Maybe I'll like bag it or seal this up and take it to her next time I visit. Does she loves puffies? She loves cheese puffs. She loves all. You know, the, that fake puffy popcorn. I'll see if anybody here likes it. Okay. Mm -mm. Like, it's not... I know I always say this. It's not horrible. It's not bad. No. <laughs> Those other Pringles were pretty bad, actually. I'm not gonna lie. Um... It's just not for me personally 
Like, okay, flavor, junior. <laughs> ah, pit bulls, if you know, you know. <laughs> junior, go do that somewhere else. Um. Okay, so it says it tastes like ch sharp cheddar and ranch. So flavor-wise, I'm going to give it a two. Not at all. Not at all to me, at least. Maybe if you've tried these, let me know if you thought they tasted like what they say on the bag. Flavor-wise, no. Two out of ten. Texture-wise, eight out of ten. Like, excellent texture. Um, Like, flavor tour, for me personally, I give it a four because I'm not a big fan. It tastes like sour cream and onion dip on a puff so you know I might try the other flavors I don't know I'm not really sure like pizza and barbecue doesn't sound good to me I can't remember the other flavors so I'm sorry but like will I buy this again personally for me no you know I might end up buying it again if mom likes it or something but uh yeah I don't know. If you like sour cream and onion dip and you like ch puffs, uh, puffy snacks, I highly recommend this. Personally, I'm I'm not so much of a puff person because I feel like I can eat too many. And they're just like filler food, you know what I mean? So that's me personally. Um, Cause they're just, they break down to nothing as you're eating them so they don't really fill you up. And then, like, also, like, the flavor isn't that great to me. So, yeah. I probably will not buy these again for me personally. I might see what mom thinks. I see what a couple people in the house think, you know, and go from there. But personally, for myself, no. Like I said, flavor-wise, flavor true to the packaging, 2 out of 10. So, uh, that's just because it does not taste like either of these things to me. Like I said, if you have tried these and you think differently, please let me know. Share your review. I'll share it on my page. Um, let me know if you've tried these or if you haven't tried these, what you think. And, uh, stay humble, stay kind, and <laughs> look out for the normal people. Okay. Laters. Wait, hold on. No, I need to really fat it up for the camera. Okay.